All right, now we're doing free code camp, new responsive web design, learn CSS colors by building a set of colored markers, step 35. So now that we've gone through all the primary, secondary, and tertiary colors on a color wheel, it'll be easier to understand other color theory concepts and how they impact design. All right, so first in the rules one, two, and three, we're gonna adjust the values in RBG function so that the background color of each element is set to pure black. Remember that the RGB function uses the additive color model where colors start as black and change as the values of red, green, and blue increase. Okay. So basically we're just going to say zero, 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 just like that. And then we're going to take this and we're going to cut it, copy it, I say, and paste and paste and that's good enough in my opinion looks like it's good enough in their opinion and submit it and now we're on to step 36 and we'll see you next time